welcome to Visital, where magical stories came alive with a wag and a whisk. Get ready for laughter, learning, and endless adventures. The Monkey and Crocodile. Once a monkey and a crocodile were friends. The monkey lived in a berry tree on the bank of the river where the crocodile lived. The monkey used to feed on the berries and share them with the crocodile. One day, the crocodile took some fruits home for his wife. The wife tasted it and loved the fruit. She asked her husband, Where did you get these from? The crocodile then told her about his friend, the monkey. The wife expressed her desire to eat the monkey's heart. The crocodile refused, but she continued to persuade her husband. My dear, I can't bring myself to ask the monkey for his heart. He is my friend and it's an absurd request. Absurd? Do you not care about me? I have heard monkey's hearts are the most tasty delicacy. I must have one. But love, he is my loyal friend. I can't betray him. I don't care about your friendship. If you truly love me, you will bring me that monkey's heart. I have heard they are succulent and unparalleled in taste. It's not that simple. He trusts me. I can't just betray him for a culinary desire. You are being sentimental. If you want to do it willingly, then find a way to get that hurt. I must taste the delicacy everyone talks about. Finally, he gave in. He was upset as he loved the monkey much and did not want to see him killed. The next day, he lied to the monkey that his wife had invited him, the monkey, for dinner. The monkey gladly accepted the invitation. He jumped on the crocodile's back and reached the middle of the river. The monkey noticed that the crocodile was looking lost. The crocodile could no longer hide anything. He said that his wife would eat his heart. He didn't want to cheat his friend but was left with no other option. The monkey was shocked but he calmed himself and sat in a friendly tune. Why did not tell me earlier? I left my heart on the tree. Let's swim back to the bank to get it. The foolish crocodile immediately agreed and quickly swam back to the river bank. The monkey quickly jumped off the crocodile's back and climbed up to the topmost branch of the tree. He shouted, You fool! How can someone live without his heart? You don't deserve to be my friend. Get lost! The crocodile was sad to lose his good friend forever. Moral Foolishness can make you take wrong decisions. Thanks for joining us on this busy tale adventure. Don't forget to subscribe for more whimsical tales. Until next time, happy wagging and whisking.